They're oftentimes not respected enough, but groundsmanship is an honorable profession. Just ask Nigel Newton or read his newest book, which is a labor of love between himself and his daughter Tara Mears. Inspired by Mears to pursue his passions and to document his lived experiences in sports, the well-respected cricket groundsman last year published the book Groundsmanship, an Honorable Profession, the workbook and handbook about his life and work since starting in 1979. Um, the reason that I wrote this book is that with all the knowledge that I would have acquired over the years, I thought it was a good idea that I could put something in writing, something tangible that can attest to the, the art of Gwangmanship and maybe for the young Gwangman to look forward to. Newton shared that he started out as a timid youngster at the St. Catharines Club back in the 1970s and worked his way up for the past four decades. Well, I started out in 1980 at St. Catharines Club. It was just a, for me, it was just a job. Um, but I would have a personal knowledge there with the help of the late Terry Watson and, and others. And I would have moved on to Lodge quickly after, after about a year, late, late um, 1980-81, I moved to Lodge. And I would have spent 15 years there doing pitches, um, football field, track and field, that kind of thing. And I transferred to Leicester Vaughan in 1999, actually I transferred to Leicester Vaughan. And I would have done about 18 plus years there also. Um, I started out in the grounds at Leicester Vaughan and I believe that's where I came to national attention in terms of groundsmanship, um, being at Leicester Vaughan and working for the Barbados Youth. While explaining that the money was low at many points in his early career, Newton said that he did not allow it to stop him from the heights of success. I, I love, I, I fall in love with groundsmanship because I'm, a, I'm an avid sports person. I played um, football at parish level. I played um, cricket at division one level. I played um, basketball at, at division one level. I even played, um, I even played volleyball at division one level. So because of my love for sports, uh, groundsman shit would have brought me into the realm of sports. In the book, he also provides financial pointers to training groundsmen about cutting out bad habits, such as alcoholic overindulgence and overspending. As for final words for younger people coming up, Newton advises to do it for the love, but to work hard.